Hi, I'm Lou, and today I'm going to show you how to turn a wine barrel into a storage unit. I already did this, but I'll reenact the steps here. I drilled a hole there and there, put in screws to hold the band in place, and then cut through the band with an angle grinder. I cut the band here, 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 and here. Next, I cut just under this second band here with this oscillating tool. And I did the same thing just above the second band on the bottom. After those cuts, our door just falls right out. Inside, held in place by plastic tubes, are wooden slats which help flavor the wine. They look like this when they're pulled out. After taking them all apart, I can see they'll be perfect shelf boards. And about halfway up, the diameter is 24 inches, and I want the shelf to be about 19 inches deep. So I picked the best boards and I laid them together so I'd get 19 inches. Next, I mark a spot that's 12 inches from the back edge and halfway across. We'll put a temporary screw in this. Now I'm using a sharpie and a one foot rope to draw a circle all the way around. Flip them over and number the back side so you remember the order. Now we cut along all the lines. There are all the boards cut and I'm going to put two cross members like this but underneath the shelf. Now I'll nail them on and then bend all these nails over on the back side. I want to install the shelf right about here. So I'll put in a couple screws back here. And then one at the same height on each side. And in goes our shelf. We can't really make this a hinged door because if you open it up like this, the hinges would rip out. So we'll make it a lift out door instead. Using little pieces of our shelf wood with holes drilled in here, I'll put in stops here and here. I'll also put a stop here on the bottom of the door. These will keep the bottom of our door aligned. We're going to use this device to latch the door on top. I've mounted this piece of it to a board and we'll screw it in right under here. I'll attach the other part on the door like this. Last, we'll attach this handle in the top center of the door. There it is. Thanks for watching and good luck converting your wine barrel.